talk Israeli. It's one of the major languages in Africa. Uh, we, we operate in Africa, and we operate in this part of Africa. We have we are uh, very strong in Kenya, we have an operation in Tanzania, we are in Rwanda, we are in Uganda. I, I used to work in Uganda in the group. Uh, so so it's, 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 it's beautiful, actually, because uh, you are trying to promote a language in Africa where you are trying to do your own business as well. So that's the initiative that we wanted to take. So this award, uh, when we were doing the last award in, um, in, in Dar es Salaam, uh, I think the Honorable Vice President Sanya Zureh, she was the guest of honor and we said that let's take it a little bit more uh, and let's talk and give a little bit of support to children and students who want to pursue pursue, you know, pursue Israeli and do well in Israel. We already have a award at the top level but then we wanted to also support students who are excellent and who want to do, who need support and who want to promote Israel. So that's how this, uh, this award uh, this scholarship is that we initiated. We basically had, this was basically between Alaf and the University of Dar es Salaam. We said we want to support and the university wants to uh, follow the process in terms of identifying good students, students who need and who want to do well in Israel. So that's how we want, uh, that's how we started this and that's, that's that, and, and I think it's, in fact, uh, it, 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 there could be a stage that we want to go a little bit below and maybe start supporting at the school level also. It's possible. So just that we have supported at the top level, <coughs> come to one level down, and then and, 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 and ensure that the government initiative, the initiative of uh, Tanzania is very proud of Kiswahili, and Tanzania wants to promote Kiswahili as much as possible, uh, and the government really wants to do, and it's also our responsibility as part of a corporate, co corporate to ensure that we work very closely, hand in hand with the government, and take these initiatives forward. So that's how uh, we started this, and thanks a lot. Uh, to, uh, to to you both, both the professors and us. Good evening. I'm Anita Tambulisho and I'm Professor Tituwa. I'm going to present to our Shahada Zawu. I'm Zamiri. I'm going to finish our Makamu Kuwa Chokucha Nazam, Professor William Anangisi. I'm going to talk to you about how to get to the Shirik, and how to get to the Shirik, and how to get to the Shirik. Na miliagiza niweze kuja kumuakulisha katika kikiu hili muhimu katika tuwechitu kikucha la islamu. Kwa unyenyekefu mkubwa ni mekukea na minareta salamu zake kwenu. Kwa kuomba sahaka sambamani kwa kutu kuweza kufika yeye binafsi. Kwa mbana hiyo minareta salamu kwenu katika shuri hii ya makabiliano ya mkataba wa ufadili wa kampuni ya mabati ya Arab Limited Kwa wanafunzi watatu wa atakao kwenda kusoma degree ya umagiri katika kiswahili katika chochetu kiuchukiku cha la islamu. Mweshimiwa mtindaji mkuu wa Alaf, Mdukibitu Mohan. Mweshimiwa mimeja wa masoko Alaf, Mdukisamba Kasaka. Viongozi na wafanyakazi wa Alaf. Viongozi na wanatumia ya chukiku cha la islamu wanafunzi ambao wanafajiriwa na alas wanahabari mabibi na mabwana habari za asubuhi awali ya yote ni napenda kutumia kumisa hii kumshukuru sana mwenyezi mungu kwa kutuwezesha kukutana asubuhi ya leo katika tukio hili muhimu la makabiliano ya mkataba wa ufadili wa ada kwa wanafunzi watatu wana upenda kusoma liki ya umahili katika kiswahili. Kwa namna ya pekee, nina ushukuru uongozi wa kampuni ya Arab kwa uamuzi wao wa kutoa ufadili kwa wanafunzi wetu. Hili jambo nila kuungu wa mkono. Kwa ni wahenda walisema, umoja ni kufu na utengano ni mdaisi. Mabibi na mabwana, sote tunafahamu damila ya dhati ya serikali yetu ya omi ya tano katika kukuza na kuendeleza kiswahili ndani na nje ya Tanzania ambayo dhamira hii inasimamiwa kwa karibu na kwa namna apekee na mweshimiwa raisi Dr. John Pombe Magufuli dhamira hii inaweza kufanikiwa tu ikiwa sote kwa nafasi zetu tutajitoa kwa dhati katika kusimamia mbaka